everybody and welcome to our online Sunday school program. I'm teacher Joanna. I'm master Joshua. And I'm teacher Anjila. And before we start our program, let's bow down in a word of prayer. So close your eyes. Let us pray. Lord Heavenly Father, Lord Jesus, we thank you for this beautiful morning. Lord, we pray for the program that we are about to do. Lord, bless each and every one of us and bless those who are listening. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. 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 So, does anyone remember what we learned last week? Yes, we learned about the 12 disciples of Jesus. 12 disciples. Yes. Let's name them. Simon, who became Peter. Okay. Andrew. Yeah. James. John. And then we have Philip, Bethlehemu, Thomas, and Matthew. And then we have James, and then we have Simon, and then we have Titus, and the last one was Judas. So, Jesus called all of them to follow him, just like he, just like he did in the memory verse we given to you. So let's watch the videos. Today my memory verse is Matthew 4, 19, and it goes like this. Jesus said unto them, follow me and I will make you pictures of men. Thank you. Amen. Say my Bible verse today. It goes like this: Matthew chapter four, verse nineteen. Jesus said to them, "Follow me, and I will make you fishers of men." Thank you. Matthew four nineteen. Jesus said to them, "Follow me, and I will make you fishers of men." Thank you. Hello, my name is Desmond Murthy, and my memory verse is Matthew four nineteen. Jesus said unto them, "Follow me, and I will make you fishers of men." I, my name is Isaac and I am friend of Jesus. Jesus had 12 disciples, Simon, Peter, Andrew, James, John, Matthew, Philip. Hi, my name is Shanbi. I am a friend of Jesus and the remaining disciples are Bethlehemio, Thaddeus, James, son of Alphaeus, Thomas, Simon, the Zealot, Judas. We are going to say the memory verse. Matthew chapter 4 verse 19. Jesus said unto them, follow me. And I Matthew 419. Jesus said unto them, Follow me, and I will make you fishes of men. Thank you. Praise the Lord, my name is Debra. Matthew 419. Jesus said unto them, Follow me, and I will make you fishes of men. Thank you. Matthew 419. Jesus said unto them, Follow me and I will make you fishers of men. Amen. Matthew 419. Jesus said unto them, Follow me and I will make you fishers of men. Matthew 419. Jesus said unto them, Follow me and I will make you fishers of men. The twelve disciples of Jesus, Simon, Peter, Andrew, James, John, Matthew, Philip, Bethamelio, Jude, James, Thomas, Simon, Judas. Hello, my name is Shora. My memory verse is chapter Matthew, chapter 4, verse, verse 19. Jesus said, follow me and I will make you pictures of men. Thank you. Matthew 4.19 And then he said to them, Follow me and I will make you fishers of men. And I am going to set the twelve disciples in their names. Peter, Peter, Andrew, James, John, Philip, Bartholomew, Matthew, Thomas, James, Simon, Judas, and Judas Cariot. Thank you. So here's my art and craft. And my Bible says written in the fish. Bible verse. I called Matthew for 19 and he said to 
them. Follow me, I'm the fishes of men. Thank you for your awesome videos. And now it's time to sing some songs. Our first song is Happy Happy Happy. So let's be happy. Happy, 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 happy in the Lord. Praise God, I'm born again, trusting in His word. I want you to know how happy I am. For I am happy, happy, happy in the Lord. Alright, we are all so happy to be children of God. What's our next, next song? It's bubbling. It's bubbling. Alright, two, three. It's bubbling, it's bubbling, it's bubbling in my soul And singing and laughing, since Jesus made me whole Some folks don't understand me, how can I keep it quiet? It's bubbling, 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 bubbling day and night Hello! Hi Jack! How are you doing? I'm good, and you? I'm fine, thank you. So, what are you here for? I'm going to tell you a story about miracle. Oh, wow, really? I love stories with miracle, but who will do the miracle? Let's get on the story and find out. Yay, it's story time. One day, Jesus and his disciples went up on a mountain. A crowd followed them. Did Jesus send them away? No, Jesus loved the people who came to him. He healed the one who needed to be healed. He taught about God too. The people stayed and stayed until evening. He knew the people needed food. There was no town, no restaurant. It was not easy to feed those hungry people. They didn't get their lunch. No. I think Jesus had a plan. He knew how to feed 5,000 people. One of his disciples named Andrew found food. Here is a boy with five small loaves of bread and two small fish. He said, that's not enough for all these people. How many people would five small loaves of bread and two small fish feed? Not for all. Yes, the lunch was enough for one boy, not 5,000 people. Andrew was right. That lunch wasn't enough to feed all the people. But in Jesus' hand, that lunch was enough to feed all those people and have leftovers too. Wow! Yeah, so Jesus asked his disciples to tell the people to sit down. All the people find a place to sit on the grass. The way we sit on the ground when we go for picnic? Yes, Jesus took the bread and fish. He looked up to the heaven and thank God for the food. He broke the bread and fish in pieces. Then Jesus asked his disciples to pass the bread to the hungry people. Soon all the people had enough bread. Jesus blessed and broke the fish too. His disciples gave the fish to the people. Soon all the people had enough fish. Wow! You know, that day, Jesus fed 5,000 people with one boy's lunch of five small loaves and two small fish. After people had all the bread and fish they wanted, there was food left. Jesus' disciples picked up 12 baskets of leftover bread and fish. That was a mighty miracle. Yes, a miracle. Yes, Jesus met the need of those hungry people. Jesus cared about them. Jesus did not just meet needs in the Bible times. He will also meet our needs now. That was a wonderful story. Well, I'm glad you liked it. I love this story too. Uh, do you want to do some art and craft? Yes, let's go. So now it's time for some art and craft. But before we do our art and craft, let's learn our memory verse for this week. And our memory verse is Mark chapter 10 verse 27. And it reads, Jesus looked at them and said, With men it is impossible, but not with God. For all things are possible with God. 
for us some things might not be possible to do but with our mighty god it is all possible for him once again our memory verse is mark chapter 10 verse 27 jesus looked at them and said with man it is impossible but not with god for all things are possible with god all right now it's time to do our art and craft and for this week since we've learned in the story jesus fed 5000 people with two fish and five loaves of bread these are our five loaves of bread so we are going to make a basket and we are going to put our two fishes one on this side and the other one on the other side like this and then we'll put our five loaves of bread into the basket all right so now i'll show you how to make the basket and the fishes and bread so the things you'll need first of all some colored A4 paper, some glue, a scissors, be careful with the scissors, ask an adult to help you with the scissors, some colored pencils, and a sharpener if you need one. So let's begin. So why don't you first take an A4 paper? We need a square paper. So what you do, fold it as such. You can ask your mom and dad to help you with this. Right, so after folding that, you take your scissors and you cut along this line. So we are going to cut this up. Be very careful with the scissors, it may, you may cut yourself, so ask adult to do it for you. So cut straight along the line. All right, so you've cut that along. Now keep this, don't throw it yet. Okay, we'll put that aside. Now you have an A4 size, sorry, a square paper. So what you do next, you fold the one side to about two thirds of the page as such, and then you fold, make a line, turn it around and do it the other way as well. On, put it onto that line and fold it as well, make a line. And then you turn the paper, same thing again, take it to about two thirds of the page and then you fold, right, and then the other side again, okay, so that is done, we have made our lines, now what you do, take one side and fold it in half, fold it in half like this, okay, and then what you do, is take a scissors, and cut half moons on each side. So to help you with that, you can take a tape, take a pencil, put it on the edge and make a half, a half moon sort of. And the other side as well. Make sure it's equal on both sides. All right, so once you've marked that, take your scissors and then you can cut along. Cut. Right, the other side as well. Okay, so now you've cut those half moons. Okay, now what you do, you need to cut the paper. So what you do, remember when you fold it in, in two thirds, just cut along the other line, like, I've, like I'll show you. So go. Cut up to there. Be careful to cut only up to that line. The other line as well. Cut, cut, cut. Till that line. Turn it around. Cut along that line as well. The other side as well. Alright. So we have cut it. Now it's time to glue it all together. So take your glue, put some glue, we'll, we will po uh, paste it like this. So what you do, put some glue here and put some glue this side. Then you take it and paste it onto the square part. Paste the other side as well. Paste. So that is pasted. Turn it to the other side, same thing. 
put some glue here as well put some glue here as well okay paste and paste it should look like a basket now that is done what you can also do is paste the inside as well so put some glue the square part and stick that as well the other side as well and paste okay so remember we kept this piece of paper so what we'll do we'll use this to make the arm the handle sorry so what you do is just fold it in half as such to make it a bit thicker so take some glue just glue this together okay and then you can take some glue and glue the edges same as this side what you do stick one side like this bend it over and stick it over here as well so that is our basket made now what we'll do next is we'll take our memory verse we'll take another piece of paper and then we'll write our memory verse onto that piece of paper so our memory verse was mark 10 27 so you can write it along as however you want so mark 10 27 okay you can write that out and then you can cut it and you can paste it as such okay and then what we'll do our story was based on jesus feeds five thousand with two fish and five loaves of bread you can see jesus feeds five thousand with two fish and five loaves of bread you can write that out also in a piece of paper as such however you want right and then you can cut it out and you can paste it as such so after pasting right this is one that i've already made i've pasted the memory verse in front i've pasted the uh, story on top next what we'll do is we'll make some fishes and some bread okay so what you do take another piece of paper we'll put this aside for now we'll draw some fish I'm not so good in drawing, but I'm sure you guys are very good in drawing. So what you'll do is we'll draw a fish. Let's draw a fish together. So you go like this. Hopefully your fish is better looking than mine. As such, draw, draw. Okay, and then draw two lines as such. Then we'll draw the eyes, right, and then we'll draw the mouth, it's a happy fish, and then we'll draw some tails on the side. After drawing, you can take a scissors and cut it out, and, it, and you can color it up and it will look something like this. So you need to make two of this, okay? So after making the two fishes as such, Right, we've got our two fishes already done. Next, what we'll do is we'll make some bread. It's easy as well. So what you do, go like this. Okay. And then you draw as such. And then you keep drawing. You can draw however you like. And again, you can cut it out and then you can color it as such. After you've made five of these, one, two, three, put two more inside the basket, four, five. So that's five loaves of bread and two fish. So your basket was already done. You take your fish, you put it inside the basket. You can use the tail part as such, the two fish are on the side. Take the bread, put it inside. And that is our basket containing two fish and five loaves of bread. I hope that you will try this at home, uh, learn your memory verse. And once you are done, take a short video and send it to us and we'll show it in our next program. Just like we learned in the story today, Jesus used the small boy's lunch to help feed 5,000 people. Just like he was Jesus' little helper, we can also be Jesus' little helpers. Do you want to be his helpers? To be Jesus' little helper, we need to ask him to forgive 
our wrongdoings and invite him in our hearts. If you want to accept Jesus into your hearts, please say this prayer with us. Let us all close our eyes, put our hands together and repeat after me. Dear Lord Jesus, Dear Lord Jesus, come into my life. Come into my life. Forgive all my wrongdoings. Forgive all my wrongdoings. And make me your little helper. And make me your little helper. Amen. 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 So now we are all little helpers of Jesus. So we've come to the end of our program. Can we sing one more song? One more song? All right. Let's sing I've got peace like a river. I've got peace like a river. I've got peace like a river. I've got peace like a river in my soul. I've got peace like a river. I've got peace like a river. I've got peace like a river in my soul. I've got love like the ocean. I've got love like the ocean. I've got love like the ocean in my soul. I've got love like the ocean, I've got love like the ocean, I've got love like the ocean in my soul. I've got joy like the fountain, I've got joy like the fountain, I've got joy like the fountain in my soul. I've got joy like the fountain, I've got joy like the fountain, I've got joy like the fountain in my soul. I've got Jesus, 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 I've got Jesus, 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 I've got Jesus, Jesus, Jesus in my soul. I've got Jesus, 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 I've got Jesus, 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 I've got Jesus, Jesus, Jesus in my soul. Thank you so much for joining us this week. We hope you learn your memories, do your art and craft and send your videos. See you next time. Bye. Bye.